All right, everybody. It's me, Gregory Manorino. It is Thursday, February 11th, 2021. Here we go. Yet again, initial jobless claims for the last week, another 793,000. Another, look, I'm getting tongue tied. Another 793,000 people applied for first time unemployment benefits. And wouldn't you know it, stock futures are higher across the board, pointing towards new record highs for the market, literally at the open in about 40 minutes from now. Of course, this can change, but you know how this works. The worse the economic news gets or is, the higher stocks are going to go. This phenomenon has been in play for years, years right now, and we, we all know why. I mean, this is the most sick, twisted environment in the history of humanity, uh, even beyond humanity. There's been nothing like what we're seeing here. It's incredible. Uh, and and it's, it's so sad. It really is uh, what's happening. We have Wall Street right now. Think about it. Record highs. Every day this week, the stock market has hit, the stock market in one capacity or the other, an index, has hit a new record high. Meanwhile, America, its citizens are being destroyed. Small businesses, gone. Gone. What did we lose so far? 70? 70% 70 of small businesses are now gone forever. They're not coming back. Uh, great beyond Great Depression levels of unemployment, but you know, you got to get the fake numbers that they're telling you. We are at great, we are lower than Great Depression levels of unemployment right now, but you're not allowed to know that. This is an engineered collapse of the economy to destroy, by design, Whatever was left of the middle class to finish what the Federal Reserve started in 1913 to create a two-tier society, this new world order is in our face. It's in our face. Uh, and the last two presidents, and this one's following right behind them both, did everything they could to allow the central banks to gain more power. The last two presidents, Obama, Trump, and now Biden, uh, are, are making the Federal Reserve so powerful. Again, the Federal Reserve is the government, all right? Presidents are, are, are puppets of the central banks right now. I told you all this would happen uh, as the so-called patriots sat by and did nothing. Uh, it, it's a joke. It really, really is. Uh, oh, we're going to bankrupt the Fed. Trump is trying to bankrupt the Fed. I mean, duh. All he did was empower the Federal Reserve, because every single dollar they're called on to issue of more debt, the more powerful they become. This whole thing really, really got started uh, due to the engineered meltdown in 2008 under Obama. <laughs> Trump took it right over, and here we go with, the, with this new creature uh, sitting behind the Resolute Desk, and it doesn't matter. Again, they are puppets. Puppets of the central banks and uh, the Federal Reserve is determined to wipe out the middle class and they're, they're doing it. They are wiping out the middle class, destroying this country. Uh, but I guess the Patriots, you know, they had to raid the wrong building, duh, because they were told to do it. They should have raided the Federal Reserve with a bunch of useful idiots, I'm telling you. Yeah, I get upset at this kind of stuff. When I hear that another 793,000 people are now applying for first-time unemployment benefits, and the stock market continues to go higher like I said it would, well, yeah, it does bother me. We got Bitcoin right now, uh, 48,000 cryptos across the board getting a bit higher. Gold and silver catching a bit as well. Dollar is weaker, 10-year yield 1.14. You see the setup here, people. You see the setup here. And, you know, other than you, and I know you get it, no one's doing a damn thing about it. You got the mainstream uh, media channels. You got some YouTube blogs uh, pushing the fake narrative. Uh, you know, I don't know what's going on, but you got to be very, very careful who you listen to these days, 
because we are in some kind of twisted freak show, and, and we haven't even seen the worst of it. We haven't even seen the worst of it yet. I mean, like I said, a whole new set of rules are coming. Uh, COVID concentration camps, jail time, fines, uh, double masking, triple masking. I mean, they don't want you to breathe, I guess. Uh, n- no free thought. Free thought is not allowed. Free action and free movement. You think that's allowed? No, they got it all covered here. They want you a slave. They are creating a dependent slave society right before our eyeballs. And nobody except you and me are speaking out against it. It's an incredible thing what we are watching here. It's a, it's a new paradigm, people. It's a new freak show, and it ain't going to be pretty as we move forward. It ain't going to be pretty. It's going to get so much more hideous than it is right now. Anyway, uh, look, I got you covered, all of you, from a financial standpoint. I think you would have to agree. I put you all in the right spots. I'm telling you what to do to capitalize on the situation, but this is so much worse, so much deeper. Uh, Our freedoms, our liberties are being stolen away. Uh, This has been going on uh, since Obama, straight through Trump, and right now on the Biden, and we're just done. Um, It's crazy. It's such a terrible situation for not just the United States. This is a global phenomenon, people. There's not enough of us awake enough to do a damn thing about it. The, the real government has every single, every single angle covered. There are think tanks. They've thought this out. They are decades ahead of where we uh, c- currently think we are. All right, People, for the most part, uh, are living in, in the past. Okay, every, the, the trajectory for the world has already been thought out <laughs> over a century ago all right, with the creation of the Federal Reserve in 1913. And um, again, they're just pushing society, the global society, the global population uh, in, in, in the, any direction they want to. And the direction they have us all on is a pathway to tyranny on a scale that cannot be measured. Uh, a one world government, which we already have, the Federal Reserve is running the entire show, the entire show on a global level. The central banks, the bankers themselves, they're the government. They are the government and they got us by the throats, people, by the throats. All right, I'm out of here. Um, so again, abysmal absolutely abysmal economic news today. Another 793,000 people, first-time unemployment benefits, small businesses wiped out, Uh, a middle class that's being erased, Uh, the rich getting richer than they've ever been, Wall Street richer than they've ever been. This is the new paradigm, people. Something I told you would happen from like a decade ago. And here we are today watching it unfold right before our eyes. This is history. History is being made and being rewritten too. All right, look, I'm out of here. Um, I'll see you later at the end of the day. That's it.